Is that CircuitPython on an STM32? It is indeed. This right. is the STM32 F412, which is a nice chip. This one's a particularly big one. And this is the Discovery Board. This is from ST. Um, they make really nice, low-cost dev boards with like all the fix-ins. It even has like these Arduino headers. It's pretty cool. They're going to be very handy for soon as we finish up porting CircuitPython to the STM32 F4. So today I'm testing a pull request on analog input. So here I've got the uh, Moo editor, which is my favorite CircuitPython editor. Real simple, just reading the analog um, voltage on pin A1 and printing it out. And then Moo has this nice built-in plotter. So yeah. you can see as I twist the knob. You're, you're twisting here. I'm twisting here. And then it's making this go It's like going that. up and down, so it's the, the analog plotter. So it's really great for looking. I can quickly tell like if I'm getting smooth um, mm. inputs. Twisty twist. Twisty twist. Am I getting the full range from 0 to 3.3? Yes, I am. So all is good. So this pull request is ready to be merged. So step by step, CircuitPython snakes its way to the STM32. Cool.